This dude here, uh, last time he came in, he kind of came in, had his book bag on, got on stage, did his shit, and rolled out, and tilled the spot. It was crazy. Then went home and he had diarrhea. It was awesome. He <laughs> put it on Facebook. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together. My name is Mel Johnson. Come on, I don't even know where to start. I'll get to the diary. <laughs> I was singing, man, I had a dream the other night, and it's about Jessica Brockman. I, I was hosting in Living Color, and I was keeping my ways, I had all these crazy Coogee sweaters, and she was all of the fly girls. She was doing that crazy Charleston Tootsie Roll dance, or whatever that was. And I loved it. That was the weird part of the best thing I've ever seen. But anyway, how y'all doing, RP, PC? It's so fast, give them more minutes, so I'm glad y'all came. People barricade themselves in the house with their fucking cabs now. I don't even know the rules in hockey. Who knows what icing is? Here, tell me right now, real quick. I got white ones. I got a white quiz. Do you know who Cleveland Mac is? <laughs> <laughs> then you are all white enough. She is strapped for the whole group. <laughs> sorry, it's kind of rocky over here. I'm sorry, I don't want to offend your whiteness. I'm really nervous. I kind of have uh, no, a diarrhea thing right now. I gotta go poop. You know what nobody told me for years? Diarrhea is a valid excuse. How do you know I told me that? I never knew that. I was like, I never shit my pants in school, though, right? Not leaving in that, but I was, there's a lot of close calls, you know what I'm saying? Sitting in class. Please tell me, please, Lord, no. Whole time I could have just been at home, watching Price is Right. <laughs> That's why I'm telling everybody. I don't know, man. I'm way too hot to be here, that's my problem. It's more like hot. I'm unemployed with it. You don't need to know all my business. I'll just talk about the weed, alright? Smoke weed and my, my pothead friends are pretty stupid, man. I am. I hate when potheads present dumb shit to you like it's cool. You know what I'm saying? It's a typical conversation. Hey, Greg, what are you doing, man? Oh, I'm just gonna sit in the house, take some phone rings, and look at Google Earth. Sex. Yeah. Why are you trying to stop me? Yeah. And I'm sick of my friends trying to tell me not to have sex with sluts. I don't care. You don't know what my problem is. Alright? Yeah. Oh, no. Hey. No mess with her, dude. Wow. She's over. Well, what are you doing tonight? Oh, I was just going to watch ESPN too. I think there's a basketball race that I missed. The hell with that sounds dumb. I'm going to have to risk getting hurt. I'm here to roll the nuts. I'm playing away, goddammit. I said, oh, bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm really out of it, man. I'm, fucking, I'm from Woodbridge, so, and I took the bus, so I've been coming here since yesterday. I'm just really like thrown off. I don't watch that the mountain time, I don't know why. I'm checking in there. Metro fucking sucks, pal. Metro's the worst thing ever. It's $82 to go one way at super peak hour, and then there's regular mild peak hour. And then I was on all these hot ass trains, all the seats were orange. This is like a Reagan era train. <laughs> you see all the crack piles still in the crevices, in the air ducts. So it's so fucking hot. Hot. I mean, I haven't said one funny thing. Oh, she I really want to apologize for this, man. I'm sorry. To all of you. Sorry for what I've done in your life. Right? Y'all need to understand my struggle, man. I'm going through a lot. All right? Been broke for a very, very long time. You ever walk in a room and look around and say, damn, I'm over right here, 15 dollars. <laughs> Just sit in the corner and see you said some other shit. Hey, come on, man. I was gonna get with you, but I had winter camp. I was around my winter camp. Yeah, I got winter camp tonight. <laughs> shit like that, man. You ever like really contemplate selling drugs? That's when you know. You know. You know exactly what I'm talking about. You made that call today, right? See what you're doing? Smoking some weed. You're like, shit, I can sell that shit, man. Smoking it. Fuck it. Simple conversion. One and two. It was dub sex, and then you can take the weed sales and turn it into a rap career. So that's how you double up. <laughs> and I was like, yes, I'm gonna do it. And I got all these fucking calls about weed. I was like, yeah, I'm about to be on. Playing it down, what? And then I watched the like, NCIS marathon, and I was like, hell no. Give me some smack in my face, man. I'm not going out with that. No more, I feel like pot. It's like pregnant. There's one word or nothing, you gotta take the seeds out. Alright, that's my time. <laughs>